As people lose jobs or avoid going out to stores, the company behind several outdoor shopping centers says it is facing challenges. Brittany Thomason spoke to Vestar about how it's trying to keep your business. Vestar owns Desert Ridge, Tempe Marketplace, and several other shopping centers. Currently, it's seeing about a 40% dip in business. A canceled spring training season meant a big loss for Valley stores that thrive during that season. Marketing director Emily Andrews says Vestar had to find new ways to attract shoppers. We've instituted a lot of virtual events, for instance, to try to keep people engaged with us. Some businesses still had to close their doors. Sweet tomatoes. Um, is one that has filed for bankruptcy and um, at Desert Ridge and that um, we believe will permanently have their doors closed. Ruby Tuesday is another concept that had to close here at Tempe Marketplace. Andrews says those companies were struggling even before COVID. She's looking forward to the holidays, a time when stores tend to see a rush of customers. Of course we're hopeful that things are going to clear up and get better as we move into the holiday, but we're anticipating a long road ahead and that's all right. Here's the good news. The future is looking a little brighter. There are even some new tenants filling space in the shopping centers. Although we've seen large dips in traffic and sales as a result of COVID, those dips are rising and we are seeing week over week increases in traffic. She says they're cleaning every hour and passing out masks so customers feel safe. Brittany Thomason, Arizona's Family.